Russian infantry banned from using armoured vehicles to attack Dnipro bridgehead. Russian forces attempting to dislodge a Ukrainian bridgehead on the Dnipro River have been banned from using armoured vehicles and are now attacking on foot as suicide bombers, Ukraine's military has said. Speaking to the United News Telethon, South Operational Command spokesperson Natalia Humeniuk said the ban was due simply to how much material Moscow's forces have been losing in the now months-long battle, the Kyiv Post reported. For a long time, we have been observing that they have a ban on using armoured vehicles during assaults, meaning that at first they were making assaults using classic tactics of fighting with armoured vehicles, she said. But they are losing equipment, so after a while they stopped using it. We found out that they have a ban on it, meaning that assaults are carried out directly by infantry groups. Humaniuk said the number of Russian attacks had dropped in recent days from 10 to 15 per day to 3 or 4. She suggested that this was because it was increasingly difficult for the enemy to assemble a group of suicide bombers and that Russian forces were losing 50 to 80 men a day. As reported last month, Ukrainian marines are deeply dug in and backed by masses of strike drones are firmly holding ground first captured in mid-October. According to a number of independent observers, no matter what Russian forces try to do, they haven't been able to dislodge the Ukrainians who will still be there in weeks and months to come.